This is the easiest, fastest trick I've found to use free 3D models to save time storyboarding. I'm on a 2015 iPad Pro, and this takes about two minutes to get the 3D model to look like a line drawing and get it on a layer in Procreate. I spent a total of 24 minutes on this frame, just having fun, but it would have taken a lot more time if I had to draw the boat from scratch. If you have to draw 20 or more of these things today, this can save you a lot of time. I'll show you how. This is the free SketchUp viewer. These are models I already downloaded, but if you don't have one, go to the little cloud in the upper right, click on the 3D warehouse, click in the search field, and then do a search. Galleon. And I chose this one. Click on this little lower right corner box with an arrow. It downloads the model to your library in the free SketchUp viewer. One finger I'm tumbling around because in the lower left I chose this uh, little orbit. Two finger pinch to move it around so you can get the ship out where you want. Click the camera icon and use the slider if you need some wide angle or long lens effect. Then go to the eyeglasses, click next to edge styles, click profiles, Maybe we'll leave off depth cue. Under face styles, click monochrome, click back on the eyeglasses. Now you hit the power button and the home button at the same time. That saves a screenshot to your photos app. Hit the home button to go home. Now I launch graphite, I think this is $7. Hit load from photos. There's the photo I just took. Now down here, Near the middle, I hit charcoal, then I hit edit, hit paper, choose the first one, which is white paper, apply that, choose the brightness slider, maybe I'll brighten it up, apply that, then choose the adjust, and there's various controls you can play with. Uh, sketchiness can be fun, kind of blurs it out, but it looks like you drew it, or you can go all the way to hard lines. The sliders for black point and for depth can help simplify complex photos. Let's see, contour, bring that down, apply. Anyway, you can have fun with that, but I'll just hit save. It takes a minute to save to your photos, so I'll go to Procreate, get a new one. And then under the wrench, click Add, Insert a Photo. There's my photo. And click the Select tool. It's freehand now. So I can get rid of just tracing around, just like the lasso tool in Photoshop. Grab all that, and then three fingers swipe down and select Cut. Now I can grab my brush. my color, whatever that is, and start drawing. Oh, and I should probably put the ship layer, it's N for normal, I'll click on that, drag down and make it multiply. And then you have various brushes for shading. I can go up here, make a new layer, click on it, rename it. change it to multiply, pick a new color, size and opacity, undo, so now you can play with that. You can also go, you can make that layer invisible, you can go to the ship layer, click on the arrow, and you have controls to manipulate it. I'll click on freeform. Uh, if I hold down on one dot, it'll change just that. You make it look like it's going faster. You can also warp it if you wanted. You can reset it in the lower right, but if you just click on another tool, it goes back. And don't forget to have fun.